Hey YouTube, welcome back. Welcome to another video. If you are new, my name is Sarah and today we are doing another unboxing. Yay! So this is actually my second box that I have gotten from Cosbox. Yes! Um, it's kind of like, what do they call it? Socially responsible. Let me look it up and show you. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. And before we get to the unboxing, don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell so you never miss another post notification from me. I do post about twice a week usually. Let's get into it. So... As for the cost, it's really similar to FabFitFun. Um, you're getting full size items, really unique things. It's about, I think it was about 50, yeah, it's about $50 a box. Um, and if you do like an annual subscription like I did, of course, because I'm willing to pay more to save more, the price drops a bit, okay? What is Causebox? Okay, Causebox is a quarterly curation of socially conscious lifestyle products for women. Every box is filled with products that have a story and make a difference. So just to give you an example, in the first box that I got, which was winter 18, I got like uh, this really fancy jewelry that's made, you know, by a tribe of women in Africa, for example. But the difference is that while these are products that are made by groups like that, they're super high quality. You would totally find them in typical retail stores here in America. Um, and then like another thing that I got, let me get this open, that I got was a pair of headphones. They were Bluetooth headphones um, and they were really pretty. They had like marble um, kind of like details on them marble coloring and they were by I think a brand called listen and the deal was that for like every set of those headphones that was purchased um, or like one of our boxes for example a pair of hearing aids I believe was provided to a child in like a third world country or something like that now to be honest unfortunately the sound in those headphones totally sucked there was absolutely no bass and they were all trouble and I gave them to Goodwill <laughs> and I, I gave them the Goodwill because when I looked into selling them on eBay, people were selling them for $6, even though they retail on Amazon for like over 50. <laughs> but obviously other people had the exact same thoughts that I did, just realizing the quality of the sound in them wasn't that great. But not to say that the items in the box aren't. I had some other good things. Okay, let's get into this box. Totally like FabFitFun with like the really colorful boxes. It's also, let me show you a unique print inside as well. Maybe I'll hang on to this box actually and try to find something to do with it. So we have a newsletter to start with. Oh, I can't wait to get into this. This is an item that I got to choose the color of because like I said, I went for an annual subscription so I got to customize my box a lot like the FabFitFun and this is they call it like a portfolio I believe wow it's big this is like I don't know like nearly like um laptop size definitely past so on the back embossed here into the leather it says designed in California ethically made in China. Okay, so there, there it is saying that's made in China. So I got the pink one and the front here, get off this plastic, don't need that. We've got a rose gold, little touch here, okay. Um, so, oh, okay, so here it is. So the brand is Glass Ladder & Co. So the snap detail on the inside is also rose gold and it's just a, a big old pocket here on the front it's just got it's got a place to put I don't know maybe like a stylus it's a little weighty I mean the the leather quality on this is really nice um, the stitching is really nice I mean there's a nice place here for me to put like 
an iPad. Um, you can, it's got like credit card, credit card slits, I guess. Like, so if you're going like this, yeah. So they're like opposite facing pockets. So this way and then this way. Um, but I like that we've got a sort of crisscrossing cuts in the leather for the pockets. That's a really cool detail. So I think this is really pretty. I think it's great for a really like professional person. Um, you know, if I was gonna be going to a business meeting and I had various things that were the type of things that would fit in here, I would totally use this. Okay, let's move on to the next item. This is also another item I customized. There were two choices. The other one had like stars and moons on it or whatever. And this is, is it an, oh, it's a bracelet. And then it, see, it has a key. Which I am tempted to keep, but I might just gift it to someone. Because I don't, I don't know. It's really cute. It says, unlock your dreams with love. Mar Marina Debucci is the designer. Ah, see, now here we go. So our mission is to fight human trafficking. Mm. By choosing this bracelet, you are contributing to set victims free. We would love you to use your bracelet to raise awareness and speak on behalf of those who cannot speak for themselves. Together, we can change the world. Oh, trafficking is something that is like, immediately just gets my heart. Ugh, gushy. The article about the bracelet is really moving. Okay, what do we got next? We have a cognac facial cleansing sponge. It's been a really long time since I've used one of these. These used to be really popular, gosh, like, I don't know, I'd say maybe about five years ago or something. Um, so basically, they feel really like hard when they're dry. And then just when you get them wet, they get, you get them wet, they get really super soft. So you just keep them in the shower and they usually do come with a, a string like this and you just hang them like on your caddy or whatever you have in the shower. Um, and then they dry out, they get hard again, you get in the shower, they get soft again. This is really cool the design too, how it has this like flower cut out in the center. I really like that. This has, let's see, because they usually will like, they're made of different things. So this one, yeah, and they're always 100% biodegradable. So I guess I could put it out on my compost. I don't see why not. We do a lot of composting out here for our garden stuff. So that's where all of our stuff goes to. And you can just use these with whatever cleanser you use. That's generally the, the dealio with this. So, oh, cognac is, okay. So handmade with the cognac plant, um, your skin will fall in love with this natural wonder that cleans and gently exfoliates. That's right, it helps to exfoliate. Leaving your skin happy, smooth, and dewy. At first sight, the sponge may look rough, but becomes big softy when wet. Yep. Yeah, really, really great. Especially using it at night when you wanna like help get rid of all the makeup and stuff, so. All right, so. What's cool about this box is that it's not just beauty, um, you know, type things. Obviously I got the portfolio, but it's also like home type stuff. So I don't know what I will do with this, but this is a macrame, mac, yeah, macrame plant hanger. I, it's just not like the style in our house, but I kind of don't even want to take it out. Let's see if I can take it out. I, Cause I, I want to be able to put it back in its sleeve. But as you can see, I don't know. I mean, it's it's super nice. I'm sure it's like as nice as they usually are or something. So I'm gonna put it back in its sleeve. Um, it's not something I would use, but it's super nice. Wow. All True Made For Good is the brand. You guys, this is really cool because they're trying, they're trying to um, support people like the areas most affected by the wildfires in the last two years in California. So that's super recent. So they're about planting trees. So it says where throughout California and the areas that have been most affected by recent wildflower, ugh, wildfires. And the why it says over the past 
two years, California has experienced the deadliest and most destructive wildfires in its history. Reforestation efforts help recovering fire damaged lands protect water supply and combat the effects of climate change. That really gets at me. I'm from California and they, I grew up going to several of the towns that were completely eliminated from the fires and I have memories there of going roping there and riding my horses and stuff so it really makes me sad that it really touches me that someone I mean the trees need to be replaced so that's really cool all right let's get next cosmetics glow bamboo brightening mask is our next next item I'm like the worst at masks though so it says it is for nighttime. Ooh, it's super fancy. So I'm gonna refer to the newsletter to see if it tells us anything about why this is in here, what it does. Cosmetics, an esthetician and a nurse. The, the founders of cosmetics are an esthetician and a nurse. They were looking for effective skincare products that didn't contain any harsh chemical ingredients. So it's just a really, from what I see here, it's just a really natural brand. Okay, Glow is formulated with bamboo extract for physical exfoliation as well as L-lactic acid and niacinamide, niacinamide to offer a gentle chemical, exfol chemical exfoliation. Together these ingredients remove dead surface cells while working, if I could read right, while working to even skin tone for a brighter more luminous appearance. Okay. Oh, it's super nice. I really should try using that. I need exfoliation in my life. I've been just the worst lately. Rose Water Hydra Mist. Mist. Oh. <laughs> Mist Congeniality. So this is actually a toner. I've never seen a toner that's a mist. So that's really cool. I mean, talk about increasing the ease of application, right? I definitely look forward to using this. What's cool is that it has rose, which is really hydrating, aloe, hydrating, healing, chamomile, and witch hazel. Witch hazel is a really great ingredient. Um, there were, there was another brand at Sephora that I used to get a lot because it had witch hazel in it. So it's um, a great balancer for kind of like blemish prone skin. Okay, so next is this really pretty scarf. Oh, I chose this one. This was uh, the third customized item. And I kind of just went for a color that I, I wouldn't normally get, but um, I also just preferred the polka dots on this to the other choices, the other to the other patterns. Um, I'm not typically one to wear this type of a thing but again it might just become a gift and I'm totally okay with that let's see so some of these have just kind of been items that are to support like women owned businesses um, who have come from you know small backgrounds or something and one has been about helping um, to fight human trafficking so this is the Cleo Bella silky scarf so I guess she's just more of an artist and the founder of the company that made this scarf specifically it's super pretty super good quality um i will have to look up styles and stuff i think for how to wear this to see if i would i'm just not really one to wear a silk scarf mm. last item you guys Ooh, okay sweet so we have a like a night like a sleep sleep cover I'm kind of particular about these, a little bit snobby just because I have a preference. This is really tight. You guys, I have a small head. I kid you not, my my head is literally child size. My 10, oh I'm so sorry if I get this wrong, is he 11 year old nephew? has a bigger head than I do okay I have a tiny head so like the headband that came with my facial steamer this thing like is 
oh, I think it might be slightly bigger than this guy. Um, you know, for an adult, if that thing is pushing tight on me, it's definitely too tight on other uh, typical adults. So I, that is so sad. Um, the brand is Etitude, so it's like attitude, but an E. Um, I mean, it's super soft in quality, but I, so the reason that I said that I was kind of a snob about these is because when I was traveling around the world, I went traveling for six months back in 07, I really learned to rely on these. When you're going through time zones and things are changing and you're sleeping on trains and I've slept in all sorts of places, you guys, I slept in a train station, like out in the elements, okay? Um, that was not the most fun night of my life. I really prefer eye masks that are contoured. That way, they so they, they contour around your eye, and if your eyes are open but you have the mask on, then your eyelashes aren't hitting, and it's not just like smushed up against your face. So... I really don't wear any masks anymore that aren't contoured around around the face. The flat ones, I just, I couldn't wear this all night. That's really a shame. I do have to say that I had more things I really liked in my first box than this box. That's okay. But like, I'll definitely use the sponge. I'll definitely find a way to use that really nice pink leather portfolio. Um, I'll definitely be trying out that t toner mist. I'm gonna give the glow mask a try as well. And I got some good gifts. Like the, I mean, the bracelet is totally cute. Um, and I don't know, I'm, I'm tempted, especially since that was the one that really was for, a, well, that wasn't the only one for a cause, but the one that I would, would probably wear. Oh, getting long on this one, aren't I? So that is what came in my spring 2019 cause box. Can't wait to see what is in some of the other boxes. I didn't look at a whole lot at the other choices, but um, yeah. So don't forget to hit that like button down there if you enjoyed the video and don't forget to subscribe as well as hit that bell for it so you never miss any post notifications from me. Until next time, have a great day. Be blessed. Love you guys. Bye-bye.